Hi everyone, this is a reading with me. I hope you are doing well. This is for all star signs. If you're here, hello and welcome. I feel like it is a sign that there are messages for you. And I also wanted to mention as well that if you ever wanted to purchase any personal services with me, they are always on my website, shopmoonlightguidance.com, personal tarot readings, rituals to manifest different areas of your life for love, money, marriage, career, success, healing, and so much more. And there's also intention items as well, uh, like bracelets, necklaces, anklets, pom-poms, tassels, embroidered cards, which you can put under your pillow, which are hand embroidered or keep around you, sage bundles, candles, teas, and uh, the thousands of five-star reviews are at the bottom of the website, shopmoonlightguidance.com. Com. So check it out if you wanted to. If not, no worries. Let's start with your reading. Okay, so let's take a look. Okay, I'm just going to grab these cards. Okay, Got a card that has fallen on the floor. Okay, okay. Wow. Talk about an olive branch. Oh, one second. Let me grab this card off the floor. Okay. Lovers was one of the first cards that came out. I mean, it is beautiful, okay? This is definitely a love reading. This is definitely a confirmation. If you feel like you're going to be alone for the rest of your life, you know, you're always going to be waiting, you're always going to be sitting there, you're always going to be wondering, that is not the case, okay? You are going through a phase in your life right now. There will be a time, okay, in your life where you will not be sitting and watching tarot readings of this nature. You won't be, okay? You you won't be. Um, you will have moved on peacefully with your life and you will have a romantic partner and you will feel very fulfilled and very happy. And this is just a phase right now that you're in <laughs> watching my videos. You know, I mean, maybe in the future, I hope you, you know, return at some point, not because you're having romantic difficulties, but because you want to know about, you know, other areas of your life um, and things like that, you know, but I think that, and again, not because you have difficulties, but because you're just curious, but um but yeah, there's going to be a time in your life where you're not really sort of so consumed with um, wanting answers in love because that area of your life will come together, especially with the star. You know, there's a real sense of your stars aligning, things coming together for you in this regard. I see a lot of happiness, a lot of joy, a lot of positivity, a lot of fulfillment. There's an olive branch here that someone's going to offer out to you, wanting to meet you, wanting to talk to you, wanting to spend time with you some beautiful back and forth conversations that I am picking up on and a real sense of wanting to genuinely get to know you for you, which is what the um, four of pentacles is showing here as well is that they will be patient with you just like how you would be patient with them. You know, there's a real sense here of this person um, keeping to themselves right now, especially with the hermit. They're not really saying a lot or doing a lot. They're very, very in their head. They're trying to make the right choice, the right decision. Um, they don't want to make the wrong choice or the wrong decision or say the wrong thing to you. Um, they really want to make sure that they come to you properly because they feel like you deserve a proper answer, a proper invitation, a proper way of saying things and doing things because they respect you um which is something that i see okay you might feel like this person doesn't respect you because they don't really do much right now but they do okay for many of you this is a new person for some of you it can be a person that you've known or that you do know but what i will say is that this person is also healing okay they've got challenges in their life they've got emotions that they have to deal with career things that are going on in their life that are quite draining i feel like they might be starting a new project or a new job and that's quite draining and on your side you're just sort of hopeful that love comes into your life because to a degree you feel like that's the one thing missing in your puzzle it's the one thing missing in your life you feel like other areas of your life have come together and they're doing okay and that you can always work on those things but love is the one big thing that's sort of missing it's this gauging hole in your life and uh, you feel like it would be nice to have a companion right like I don't think you're asking for too much I don't think that you're you're being too much at all it's a very human and very normal thing to want a companion and to want someone to share life with and to do things with or to at least even just talk to a person who can try and understand you um, again, very, very human thing. And what I do see is that this love offer will come in and it will give you a lot of happiness and a lot of joy and a lot of fulfillment. And you will feel like, wow, this is exciting. This is beautiful. Um, and you will feel very, very good. So there it is, okay? There is a commitment that's going to come through. In fact, 
Reading I uploaded before this was very, very similar. So if you want a double confirmation, like trust me, it is here, okay? If you have been thinking to yourself, Oh, Moonlight, I don't think I'm ever going to be in a relationship. It is not true. That is your fear that is speaking. It is because past experiences haven't worked out in the way that you want to wanted it to. It's a little bit like when someone keeps getting rejected for a job. They just think like, do you know what? I'm not even going to bother going to that next job interview because I bet nothing's going to happen anyways. But at some point that person will strike luck and get a job. Okay. It, it will happen. It will happen. Um, Good news is this person comes to you. I don't feel like you have to run after this person, chase after this person, go after this person and jump through hoops for this person. I feel like they will come to you. They will realize what they want with you. They will progress things with you. They will move things along with you and they will know exactly what they want with you and from you, you know? So I think that that is really, really quite powerful and very, very significant as well. And then we've got here the Queen of Swords, which is beautiful okay why is the queen of wands uh, sorry queen of swords so beautiful i feel like we shouldn't even be asking that kind of question you know she just is okay she just is she has healthy boundaries okay so whether you're male or female i read energies and tarot not specifically genders but having healthy boundaries knowing yourself knowing what you want knowing what you stand for knowing what you wouldn't tolerate is so so important why is it important? Well, because that makes other people respect you more when you respect yourself, okay? It just is one of those things. Your self-respect makes this person very attracted to you, but it also, right now, is keeping them from coming towards you because they know they have to come to you properly, not just randomly with a couple of words and then disappear again. No, no, no. They know they have to come to you properly. They have to be mature. They have to have themselves together. They've got to be stable. It takes a little longer but it happens in the correct way. It happens in the way that gives you joy, that gives you happiness, that gives you fulfillment, okay? This is so important, so important. It is so vital and so significant and so important that you understand that this person has to come to you properly, okay? Um, because you don't just want someone to come in today and go tomorrow, right? You want them to come to you properly and to stay in your life. And sometimes it just takes a little bit longer, okay? But the universe is working in your favor, they will come in, emotionally express themselves and be serious, okay? This person will be serious. Are they a fun loving person? I think so, but they, you know, when it comes to really talking to you and understanding your needs and also telling you how they feel about you, they will be serious. They will not pass it off as a joke. And then you're left wondering, do they actually care about me or was that just a joke? No, no, they're not gonna make you think it's a joke. They will genuinely come to you and be proactive towards you because they like you and also, they don't think it's a joke, right? They don't want to be dismissed. So they're not going to come to you and express themselves emotionally and then pretend like you don't matter. Does that make sense? Because you do matter. And that's, that's what we have. So we have here the Hierophant. They will want commitment with you. They will take action. King of Wands energy. I'm just going to take my sip of water. This person cares, they find you very attractive, they like you a lot, they're trying to get areas of their life together, but there's a real sense of seriousness, okay? They will pursue you, from what I see here, and communicate with you. They will romantically come forward, they're just trying to get certain areas of their life, like money, and also themselves together, and then they are going to extend out that olive branch to talk to you, and also communicate with you which is something that is quite significant and powerful and also lovely very very lovely okay so the seven of cups really shows a beautiful energy here of this person like really coming forward having something to say and um thinking about you a lot okay this person will be dreaming about you during the night, daydreaming about you during the day, they will think about you a lot, and this love offer that comes your way is serious, it's not a joke, okay, it's not a kind of like, a, oh, I'll just entertain you for a couple of days, and then I'll disappear, no, <laughs> that sounded so serious from my side, I was like, no, 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 this person 
wants to move things along with you, wants to be with you, is not joking, okay? It does not feel like joking. This person comes to you properly, they want to be with you properly, and they like you for who you are. And I think that is so significant because they will feel like you are their soulmate, okay? They will literally say something like, you know, I, I feel like we had this strong bond, okay? It's their way of indirectly telling you that they feel like you are their soulmate my happiness is to be near you so they will really feel that their happiness is to be near you to be around you and they will feel like you know their happiness is connected to you in some way shape or form and that is really what i am picking up on here which is quite significant and quite strong they will really feel very very connected okay and that is what i'm seeing so this offer is going to come your way from this person who's trying to get themselves together it's going to be a serious offer and if this resonates with you or if you claim it don't forget to like share subscribe comment down below you know check out the description box below for information on personal services free reading giveaway intention items services etc i also have tiktok and instagram listed down below i post short readings on there every day feel free to check it out if you wanted to and i will see you all very soon bye